What's up guys, Nick here with a brand new episode of Mass Effect! Last episode we talked through the council and all they did was defend, defend, defend Saren. So now we have to go find Garrus. I know exactly where Garrus is. What guy? The one over by the keeper. Yeah, I'm not talking to him. Alright, so basically let's go to the tram. I think it's an awards, correct? No? Oh wait, we have to go talk to uh that guy at the bar. Forgot about that. That's first. Then Garrus. So let's uh oh. Assassins! They can do a pretty good amount of damage, to be honest. As long as they have a lot of shield, they can do a lot of damage. Anyway, back to what we were doing. <laughs> just take out a few of them and just walk away. Alright, the guy should... With the arrow or the exclamation mark up there, Harkin. Back off, Rex. Fist told us to take you down if you showed up. What are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. Love this Rex. He's he's my favorite uh, Krogan. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. This story is just beginning. Ooh, this story is just my beginning. Friends, I have no quarrel with you. What was that all? Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught in the middle. All right. Alliance military. <laughs> I could have been a marine, you know. Instead, I joined the goddamn Citadel Security. Just letting these people talk while we're doing while we're sitting here. Harkin, right? I was told you could help me find someone. Oh, Victoria he's going to help us find Garrus. That's Garris. right. Garrus. <laughs> You must be one of Captain Anderson's crew. Poor bastard, still trying to bring Saren down, eh? I know where Garrus is. You gotta tell me something first. So apparently before the events of this game, they've been dealing with Saren the entire time. There's something I should know about the captain? But when? Who knows? Didn't know that, did And I've been debating on whether or not to just do day of recordings, or record, like, several episodes in a single day. I'd rather do one episode a day, because, you know, I like my chill time, I don't like to record an hour, two hours, at a time, because I used to do that, and it was, was kind of horrible. Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Michelle's office. She runs the med clinic on the other side of the ward. I kind of already know where Garrus is. Back there. I'm out of here. Yeah, good. Go. Let me drink it, please. One of these days, I'm going to test it out and see if uh, you can actually get to Garrus before Tarkin Harkin. Why didn't Captain Anderson tell us? This is just just in case. Caden has hardly any shield. Main reason: after this mission, I don't. After we get more people on our team, I don't use them because I don't care for Caden. To the med clinic, med clinic. So I've been, I've been playing a lot of uh, Dragon Ball Fusion lately. I think I said that the last episode. Actually, I don't know if I had the game before the last episode or not. Uh, but it is a very fun game. I finally got. Hey, there's Garrus. I didn't tell anyone. I swear. That was smart, Doug. No, if Garrus. Dude, do you have like a smart. inverted scout? Keep your mouth shut or... Who are Can you? I have it? Let her go. I'll get back to what I was talking in a minute. Thanks for having me point it down. Let's say, is that all of them already? No, there's still those two in here. Oh, there's another one. Replenish that. Perfect timing, Shepard. Once we get done with this part, I'll faster. go back to what I was talking what about. About you could have hit the hostage. Is it fusion or fusions? I, I don't react. know. Check really quick. I didn't mean to. Dr. Michelle, I'm hurt. No, I'm okay. Yeah, Thanks it has an you. S at the end. So fusions. I know those men threatened you, but if you tell us who they work for, we can protect you. They work for Feast. 
They wanted to shut me up, keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. What Quarian? A few. She asked me Sorry. about the Shadow Book. Sorry. No, I'm not. She wanted to trade in. Then what? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid oh, even no. for him. That Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. She must have something that proves he's a traitor. Did the Quarian mention anything about Saren? Or the Geth? She did. The information she was going to trade. She said it had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. Welcome aboard, Garrus. Yeah, we got you know, Garrus! we're the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take Yeah, him. we saw him in the bar. A Krogan might come in handy. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. What's he doing there? Fist accused him of making we have to go to the CSEC. He brought Rex place. in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he leaves. Move out. And as I said, Caden is rarely used on my teams. I could care less about the character. Anyway, what else I'm up? Uh, Dragon Ball Fusions. It is... It's different than any other of the Dragon Ball games I've played. It... Of course it's fun. And it has this, like... Strat... Turn-based strategy... Where you, like... It's like Chrono Trigger. You have this line where you wait for the enemy to attack. Or where you can attack. But at some point, so, uh, someone's icon can go faster than where they attack first. And, uh... So far, the only fusions I have are Trunks and Goten, of course, and then, spoiler alert for anyone else, uh, there's actually a way to fuse with, I'm, going, I'm in the wrong place, to fuse with all five characters at once and do this, like, ultimate combo deal. Is that it? Yeah. Um, i trying to figure out which one's close. Probably that one. But when you do the, f the five way fusion, which the Ginyu Force teaches you how to use it, uh, you go into this like attack mode where you just go around and start shooting and taking out. Okay, this way to the Citadel, this way to the Citadel. Uh, shoot key blasts, attack the enemies to do like a ton of damage. Um, yeah. And you're supposed to fuse other people together and all that stuff, but I haven't got that far yet. It might be some kind of special thing at some point, but the only fusion I have is the two people I said. And I only have one character who's not a part of the Dragon Ball universe, and it's some other random character who looks like Android 18 because she has white hair. Investors are pulling their support for future projects. But overall, if you like uh, role-playing games, it's very good. I, I definitely go for it if you have a 3DS. And it starts at only $30, so it's not a full, a full $40 game, which is always nice. This is our loading screen for the elevators. Sorry for anyone who gets sick from that. Where is he? Rex is over here somewhere. There he is. When did a bunch of garrisons get over there? <laughs> saw you they kind of look alike. Sorry. Bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. Dude, I that really Krogan will kill you with a single headbutt. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. <laughs> No, there is a way. Go on. You could go yeah, yeah. after. Do I know you, human? Harkin or the broker, or whoever. Shepard. Fist. Going after That's Fist. right. Thought you can go after Fist without him, but he'll show uh, up at the end and you know get Shepard. mad at you for doing it Commander without him. Shepard. We're both warriors, Shepard. Out of respect, I'll give you a fair warning. I'm. Yeah, you don't know much about Commander Shepard either. 
You make up his own backstory, but other than that, he's a commander. Somehow. My people have a say. Seek the enemy of I just enemy. kind of hope that Andromeda you isn't a... Find a friend. I've already heard it was it's, takes Glad place after the team, third game, but Let's I kind of hope they aren't you know, fibbing and saying game. that, and it turns out to be a prequel. Alright. So he... I, I like Garrus the most, and I'm going to always keep... Well, shoot. I'm always going to keep Ashley on the team, because I'm going to romance her. Alright. Time to head back to the the den. I'm gonna try and finish all that all that stuff today. All the Citadel stuff today. That's not where I'm going. I always get confused. Let's see where we are. Uh, we're going to the Core's Den. I just like the the whole like the low screens move. You can see cars moving around, stuff like that. Sorry. I'm you have arrived at the Gentleman's Club. Yep. All the patrons in there are gonna kill us. It looks shut down. Sure. But I honestly don't use powers that much in this game. It's, it's, the powers are not that great. Second game comes around, yes, they're awesome. See? It wouldn't show us like, oh, this person's right there. You lock on to him. You don't really hit him. Though. Hit him. No, but I knocked down his cover. <laughs> that guy's just going all the way around. I'm on it. Now somehow that killed him, but I think it's just because I hit him hard enough in the head. That's it. Bag him and tag him. Stop right there. Don't come any closer. Warehouse one of those. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back or we'll shoot. Got the blue option. This good. would be a good time to find good. somewhere else to work. Yeah, yeah, right. That's a good idea. Yeah, I never like fist anyway. Later, dude. Where in the hell do they go? One goes one way, one goes the other, and Seeing then it's like they disappear. The Seriously, because we're standing right here at the door, they can't possibly get by. One goes towards the wall, one goes towards this other wall, and they're both gone. Oh no, it's Fist. Go, go, go. And yes, he has turrets. Ah. Wait! Don't kill me, I surrender! Where's the Quarian? She's not here. Oh, I he has a big old scratch on his face. Something hit him. He's lying. You better start explaining before I lose my temper. Ooh. Nick Shepard losing his temper? That's not good. You won't like me when I'm hungry. The shadow broker only I'm mad. Agents. I said on purpose, clearly. Nobody meets that was a shadow broker. <laughs> the Incredible Hulk, to me, was Even a great movie. Uh, true uh, Mark Ruffalo, but she didn't though, definitely has made the character either. his own. But when she shows up, and I like the fact that he's having a recurring roles, even if it's in the other movies. But we seriously need a Hulk movie that's just him. Give me the location. Or a movie is the Hulk. You're on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet you know, him right now. Him. You can make it if you hurry. I never want to see you again. Is that clear? Don't worry, you'll never see me again. Okay, bye. I'll take that. All right, now we have a time limit of four minutes to get to the Aquarian, which I know who it is, and anyone who's ever played this game knows who it is, but I'm not going to spoil it. Alrighty, uh, probably not going to use any of those. But we also have more people to kill. Okay, how'd I kill them both at the same time? Did one of the bullets go past his head or something? The best way to get to the Warrior, you don't have to take the tram or anything, or whatever it's called. The cab, I guess. Always tend to take everyone out first. You don't have to take a cab. You just go straight to where there's... You still have to go that way. But you take a left instead and go through the door, and it'll lead straight to her. 
So she is not that far away. And I keep saying she, so I kind of spoiled as a girl. I think it's this way, right? Yep. Yeah, no joke. She's not that far away. Did you bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? It's Tally! Where's the evidence? No way. When I first played, I played Mass Effect 2 first. I, I played one after. But I didn't like it that much. I didn't like one that much because it was so different. But this was like years and years ago. Like, a year or so before the first one came out. Or the second one came this out. Set me up. Excuse me for a second. I knew I couldn't trust him. Were you hurt in the fight? I know how to look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate the help. Sorry, I had to sneeze there. A little cough came in too. My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence. Yeah, I played the games crazy. completely out of order. I played then two, to one, two money. again before three came out, you. and then three. Need to go somewhere safe. The ambassador's office. It's safe there. Oops. Didn't mean to press that. Actually, I did. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many? Who's this? That's like an unnatural plot. Do you know how you many? To, Shepard. Making your day, Ambassador. She has information linking Saren to the Gat. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning. Which Miss... we won't. Which we Holly. don't. We won't know Holly's much about the Gath until the next game. We don't see many quarries. Is it the here? second or third? I think it's the third the game. We'll actually learn a lot, a lot more of the I was on my pilgrimage, my rite of passage into adulthood. Tell us what you found. During or my second. travels, I don't know. I, I get the, game, the games mixed Geth. up. The story and anyway. my people into exile. Side stuff. The Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I just war better not be Earth. I thought the Geth fried their If you go to where when Earth is on the uh, second game, it calls it a f what did you familiar out? cluster. Most of the core was wiped clean, but I salvaged something from For the galaxy or something like that. It's hilarious. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. Saren won't get out of this one. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Oh. Let's hear. <gasps> Let's hear it, lady. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. I feel like I've heard that name before. According to the Anyone memory the core, the Reapers knows. were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. Love that Pokemon. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life, and they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. The oh no, they'll probably still defend them somehow. In Citadel space. We have to tell them. No matter what they think about the rest of this, those audiophiles prove Saren's a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her, the Quarian? My name is Tolly. Yeah, Ashley has you kind of a. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with uh, you. Uh, specious. I'll take all the help I can get. Logic, to begin with. Thanks. You won't regret this. Third game, she calms Anderson down. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. All right. Now we. It doesn't. We don't actually have to have a tally, but I'm just gonna have it there. Because why not? I've already looked at that. Oh, no. Let's see what we get. 
Yay, I did it. I did something. Cool. I've got 85 XP. <laughs> Not a lot, to be honest. Alright, let's find the terminal and head to the council. It's around here somewhere. There it is. Excuse me, Commander Shepard. Could you spare a moment of your time? Uh, no. I think there's only like one race, at least in this game you don't get, and that's a uh, Salarian. That's also in the other ones. And Perthian, of course, but that doesn't happen until the third one. And I know I'm spoiling things, but I don't have the DLC for that one, so it doesn't it doesn't matter. I had it for the Wii U, though. It gave you all the DLC and everything. Because the Wii U didn't do uh, DLC at the time. Come on. Udin is presenting the Quarian's evidence to the Council. Here's the moment of truth. Was a major victory. I'll keep silent through this, so I'll see you in a second. Closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Benezia. She must be working with the Geth, too. Matriarch Benezia is a powerful biotic, and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do we even know what this Conduit is? Saren thinks it can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same mistake again. This is different. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. Fifty thousand years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the Conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. That is not good enough. You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in! A fleet cannot track down one man. A Citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. Every time humanity asks for help, you ignore us. Shepard's right. I'm sick of this council and its anti-human bull! Ambassador, there is another solution. A way to stop Saren that does not require fleets or armies. No, it's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. You don't have to send a fleet into the Traverse, and the Ambassador gets his human Spectre. Everybody's happy. Commander Shepard, step forward. It is the decision of the Council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the Special Tactics and Reconnaissance Branch of the Citadel. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. 
Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. Spectres are an ideal, a symbol, the embodiment of courage, determination, and self-reliance. They are the right hand of the Council, instruments of our will. Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace, both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. You are the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. I'm honored, Counselor. We're sending you into the Traverse after Sarah. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. I'll find him. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Congratulations, Commander. We've got a and now it's just been pretty much a bit going to need a ship more. Crew, but Saren has been stripped! Yes! He is no longer Spectre, and I gain his rank. <laughs> and speak to the Spectre Requisitions Officer. Anderson, come with me. I'll need your help to set all this up. Yay! I thought the Ambassador would be a little more grateful. He didn't even thank you. Until I find Saren, I haven't done anything. Come on. Right behind you, Commander. And now we have a Spectre bonus. And all that stuff just comes back. Or it was already there, I don't know. Why does Intimidate have one more? I don't know. But I have a point to use. Alright, so pretty much we, we did what we were supposed to accomplish. After this, we're just pretty much just leaving. So let's go ahead and save. And it says 10 hours. It carries over from the last playthrough. So, thank you all for watching this episode of Mass Effect. Next time, we are going to leave and start one of the other main missions. So thank you for watching. Catch you next time.